whatever, just take her out, take her out the minus. Because be positive in life. Because it's your attitude that drives everything. And why I say that is that the only thing I feel bad for the American people for is you do not see the rank and file Democrats and Republicans in Washington, D.C. working every day, all day, to try to put together good policy and good legislation. Anybody here representing the national media? Because if I'm going to insult you, I want you to know. <laughs> How about local media? Yeah, pay attention, to your, pay attention to your local media because uh, one of the challenges we have in Washington, D.C., both parties, is to spend time, effort, and in some cases money trying to get the message across to the American people of what I just said. You have good people from both sides of the aisle, working together all day, every day. We have the advantage in the UP, because we can just go outside. Cell service is optional, you may not have any internet. So what am I working on legislatively? Just that, broadband, to the point where people now who have come up here over the last couple of years because of whatever reason, living up here now, kids having school at home for a while, people working from home. Broadband is my number one infrastructure project uh, across the UP, and, and we're not alone up here. There are other parts of the country. Number two, I sit on Veterans Affairs and Armed Services. And um, most of the things I would tell you today is what we've advanced in veterans care and services here in the Upper Peninsula when we passed the Mission Act a few years ago to give communities more latitude in providing care for veterans so they did not have to go to the closest place, of course, might be Iron Mountain. Of course, you got Seabock, you got different places you know, around, but to increase the quality and the accessibility of uh, care for veterans in the community. It's not just to a VA facility, but it's to the local hospitals. But the point is, I'm gonna be around all day today uh, I'd be more than happy to engage you on any specific subjects that you may deem important. But just remember one thing, we're all God's children and we are so much better when we work together. It's okay to disagree, but remember we all represent the people who sent us here and I take that very seriously. So I'm just blessed to have all of you in the room today and I'll dialogue with you later on on things that we're choosing. So thank you for the opportunity.